This is Tyler Young with Go Engineer Tech Support, and today I'd like to show you a tool that's available inside of SolidWorks Composer called Selection Sets. This is going to allow you to choose groupings of actors that you want to select repeatedly. So in this example, I have an assembly file, well, an actor file that I created in SolidWorks that had different sub-assemblies. So in there you see I've got a door sub-assembly, I've got a side door, another one, I've got a hinge sub-assembly. But what if I want to come in and select this door, these four pieces here, along with this side of the hinge, that side of the hinge, and then the screws that are in there. That's not a sub-assembly from SolidWorks, and I so I need to create one inside of Composer. That is called a selection set. So to do that, I'm going to first uh, select my door here. Um, I'm going to turn on my assembly selection mode, select the door, and then I'm going to say create selection set. So I do that, I'm just gonna call this um, selection set door, okay? So now I have my door selection set that shows up here in my assembly tab at the bottom. I'm going to turn off the assembly selection. I'm going to come pick this side of the hinge, control select that hinge, and then I'm going to come down to my door selection set and right click and say um, add actors to selection set. Now if I come here and pick on my door selection set you can see I'm selecting that door and the two hinges, but if I zoom in you'll see I also have screws on each one of those um, hinges. So I'm going to find what set of screws those are. So those screws are this screw 8 here, and then these screws down here are screw 4. So what I'm going to do is turn assembly selection back on, select that screw, select that screw, come back down, right click again, and say add actors to selection set. Now when I come in, come down to my door selection set, I can click on that and it, if you notice, it's picking the door, the hinges, as well as the screws. So that's one way that I can create a grouping of files or of actors that I just am always able to reselect and you can see here in the selection set what they are. So this was a quick example of how to create selection sets um, in order to reuse um, groupings of files that you would want to pick. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. Thanks. Mm -hmm.